So hi everybody. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Hello. Hello, hi, teacher. Hi guys. The T G I F. Happy Friday. How are you? How's everybody? Are you having a good day? Are you having a nice one? Ready for the weekend? Or not yet. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you doing? Very good, teacher. And you? I, I, I'm doing just fine. You know, I, I guess everything's good. Uh, I have to I have to tell you, I got the vaccine today. Me pusieron la, la vacuna. I got the vaccine. But um, very good. Yeah. It's very healthy, teacher. It's very uh, healthy. Yes, I know. But I'm just waiting uh, not to get side effects. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I'm super uh, happy to. Calentura. Uh, uh, a mi jefe le dio este gripe fuerte. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm expecting. Espero que no, no tener ningún tipo de, 
the side effects. But, but anyway, so, hello. hello. Ok, guys. So, um, gracias por compartir el viernes con nosotros. Gracias por estar acá y terminar una semana más de clases. So, I'm super happy to, to, to see here que todavía estamos like, super motivated de seguir adelante, you know, y seguir practicando. Uh, today vamos a revisar vocabulario. Vamos a practicar bastante speaking. Así que I hope you get ready, you know, de perder el miedo and, and give your opinion no matter what. So, eh, como siempre, vamos a comenzar con attendance. Gracias por ayudarme con la camarita. That, that's super, super nice. Gracias a los que estuvieron bien tempranito también. So, give me one second here. Already, so let me get it started. Eh, mi, la primera persona, the first person I have, eh, como siempre es Ana, Ana Delmi. Ana, ¿está por acá? Hello, teacher. Yes, hello, good evening, and happy Friday. So I hope you're fine. Eh, Brenda, por ahí vía Brenda. Thank you, miss. Present. Thank you, hello, Brian. Uh, Jasmine. Present teacher. Thank you. Danny. Present teacher. Nice. Danny. Okay. Daisy. Lorena. Lorena. Not yet. Giovanni. Present. Gracias, Miss. Thank you very much. Giovanni, ¿está por acá? Uh, teacher Giovanni, quizá no, sea, no, no se ha conectado porque estábamos finalizando each module eh, Excel ecuaciones financieras 1. Ah, ok. Probablemente entonces todavía está por ahí, ¿verdad? Uh, se, ha, okay. se ha vuelto loco y no se quiere desconectar, quizás. De, 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 <risa> no, probablemente eh, todavía está terminando lo que tiene que hacer. Eh, Natalie. He's crazy. <laughs> eh, por ahí viene Natalie también. Natalie, Natalie. Present. Yes, there you go. Thank you, Miss. Ingrid. Por ahí veo. Ingrid ya conectada. Hello. Thank you so much, Ingrid. Hello. Hoy sí, present, Hello. teacher. Yes, ahora sí, present. Miss, le extrañamos. We missed Hoy. you yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Pero me alegra que ya esté acá. Happy you're here. Eh, Jackie. Por ahí la vi también, Jackie. Espero que siga mejor. Present teacher. Yes, Miss. Sorry about that. Espero que mejore pronto. Uh, ya la vi. Sí. I know. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Eh, Norberto. Norbert. Present teacher. Thank you, Norbert. Claribel. Clary, Clary, Clary. Hello, hello, Miss. Hello, hello, good evening. Uh, Moses. Good evening. Eh, Good evening no haciendo Moses. la cámara, voy manejando, teacher. Oh, no se preocupe, ya lo escuché. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. gotcha. Pedrina. Teacher, present. Hola, Miss. Good evening. Good evening. Rene. Rene, ¿está por acá? Present, present. Hello. Missed you as well. Present, I'm present. glad you're here. Are you home? Yes. Me alegra que I ya esté home. home. <laughs> y, que ya, y que ya no vaya a trabajar. I hopefully, you know. <laughs> They don't call you for any accident. Sí. Ah, Ricardo. Ese es teacher. Ok. Hello, Ricardo. Thanks a lot for joining. Eh, Rodas. Uh, uh, Sandra Rodas. Sandra. Ok. Ella siempre está super early. Elizabeth. Present teacher. También. Hello, Miss. Ana Jansi. Ana, Ana. Ok. Ángel Miguel. Ángel Daniel, perdón. 
Present teacher. Hello, Angel. I'm glad Hello, you're here. Teacher. Carlos yes. Alberto. Carlos? Not yet. Guadalupe? What are you? Present teacher. Nice. So you're ready, Ignacio? Okay. And Marvin? Todavía no. Okay. Okay, guys, so thanks a lot. Gracias por, eh, por unirse, you know, to this session y acompañarnos a esta clase. Eh, terminamos pretty much eh, la semana, casi la número tres, you know, eh, la estaríamos terminando el día lunes y nos queda como eh, un tiempo ya bastante cortito para el módulo, una semanita más, you know. And, and gracias porque siempre los veo conectados bien temprano. Estamos súper participativos, eh, estamos súper motivados para aprender. Así que I'm super happy eh, que vayamos avanzando también. I was listening to somebody yesterday. Me alegra mucho que en un tiempo tan cortito tenemos casi eh, ni los tres meses terminados, but eh, han avanzado mucho. Su listening está muchísimo mejor, con vocabulario están mejorándolo and, uh, y, y están dando opiniones. So I'm super happy que estamos mejorando así de rápido. And I'm pretty sure que en un tiempo bien corto ya van a estar hablando muchísimo más eh, flu fluent, fluently, ok? And uh, el vocabulario lo vamos agarrando en el camino. Así que aprovechamos la, las oportunidades que tenemos de practicar, you know, and to give your opinion, because de eso se trata, ya de quitarnos el miedo and, and to say what you think. So les comparto mi pantalla for today. Eh, we are going to be checking today, voy a hacerla más grande. This is what we are going to be doing. Vamos a hacer un breve repaso de recommendations con should, shouldn't. Eh, vamos a continuar hablando de etiquette, ok? Y pues vamos a hablar. We are going to talk, we are going to speak. Eh, ahí les comentaba de una tareita, you know, eh, ya les voy a explicar qué es lo que vamos a hacer con esa tarea. Ya está posteada por si quieren adelantarse, revisar. You can definitely do it and, and it's going to be fun, I hope. So, to get started, ayer hablábamos, hemos estado hablando de behaviors, we have been talking about etiquette, behaviors, good things, bad things. So, tengo acá, he hecho una lista de algunos comportamientos, son behaviors que para algunos pueden ser ofensivos, they can be offensive, o pueden no ser offensive. So, I want to listen to your opinion, ok, igual vamos armando vocabulario, si ven una palabra nueva, escríbanla en su cuaderno, get your pencil, get your pen, write it down, y vayan armando su propio vocabulario, right? So, um, what I want you to do is the following. What are, from these behaviors, cuáles para ustedes son ofensivos? Which are offensive for you? Which are good and which are bad? Teacher, take Hello? your shirt off when you enter a house. Uh, no, take your shoes off and is quitarse los zapatos. Yes. Okay. So yeah, the first is take off the the quitarse, right? Take your shoes off when you enter a house. You know that every country tiene como eh, reglas específicas de etiqueta, de buenas costumbres, good things, bad things. Um, let's talk about our country. Let's talk about El Salvador. So take off your shoes when you enter a house. Is this good or not acceptable? Mm, it's bad. It's bad, teacher. Yeah, right? It's Maybe bad it's in not the, a good in Salvador. In okay. China, it's good. Uh, mm -hmm. In Japan, mm -hmm. and in in Indonesia, no. In, okay, in some uh, like Asian countries, Indonesia. Okay, countries. Okay. Indonesia. Okay, so in Indonesia. some uh, some of these countries, Asian countries, it's okay, but in El Salvador, that's not the one. Okay, it is not. Thank you. What about number two? Pick your nose. What is pick your nose? What's this? Pick your uh, nose. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, like, like clean. <laughs> okay, so pick your nose, okay? Your like mouth. when you are walking and you clean your nose and you explore your nose. 
is this a good or bad behavior? Bad behavior. Bad behavior. Yeah, right. So in El Salvador, it's nothing good. What about the next one? Ask someone how much you earn. Is this okay? Ask someone how much you earn. Is this a good idea in, in our country? Is this a good behavior? Ask, oh, how much? How much you earn? Like I come for example, hey, what is your salary? <laughs> okay, is this okay? Is it okay to ask no. a person, hey, what's your salary? No. Maybe not, right? Maybe that's not a good thing. Okay. So maybe that's a bad behavior. That's something not acceptable. What about the others? What about the <coughs> others? What do you think? A really very minutes late. It's bad behavior. Behavior. Okay, a right it's 30 minutes behavior. late? No, right? That's not a good bad thing. behavior. That's a bad behavior, exactly. So we can arrive early, but not late. Okay, John in public. What about John? Like when you are super tired and you are like, oh, Johnning. Okay, is this okay? Is Johnning in public okay? Is this okay? No. Or do you think it's rude? Or it's a rude. What do you think? Uh, John in public. Mm -hmm. John in public. Is this okay? John in public is uh, come on, the certain in public. Mm -hmm. John, this word is como cuando se está muy cansado. When you are super tired and you're like, uh, <laughs> and you do that, okay? You do that. Uh, I was the Is that okay? I was the mm -hmm. in Exactly. Spanish. Is that okay? Uh, okay. Is it's that fine? Behavior. No, right? Maybe, Maybe that's not. Behavior. Maybe that's a little disrespectful, maybe. Okay, so. Y más si hacen como mucho ruido, right? <laughs> so that can be really disrespectful. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What about say, I'm going to pee? ¿Alguna vez han dicho eso? Have you ever said, oh, excuse me, I'm going to pee. I need to pee. Is that okay? What do you think? Ingrid, is that okay for you? Oh, Ingrid, no le escucho. I cannot hear you. ¿Usted me escucha? Tampoco. No se me oye. Sí me oye. Pero yo no le oigo. Teacher, with the friends. With your friends, it's okay. Ingrid, si gusta, quítele los audífonos. Déjelo como altavoz, está en el teléfono. Probablemente le, le esté dando algún falso, you know. Hoy, hoy sí. Sí, ahora sí. Probablemente el audífono tenga algún tipo de falso. Uh -huh. Ahora sí. So. ¿Alguna vez ha, ha dicho esto? Have you ever said this? Oh, excuse me, I'm going to pee. Is that okay? Uh, excuse me. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Is that okay? Is that fine? What do you think? I mean, like in a very general way. Está bien si decimos voy a ir a, a orinar, I'm going to pee. Exactamente, no. Solamente depende. Depende del nivel de confianza. It depends on the level of confianza. Okay, okay. Probably in public now, yeah. like, disculpe, me tengo que respirar. Good, or... It's good for me, teacher. Yeah, it's That's good for teacher. you. <laughs> okay, that's all right. No worries. What about this one? Hold the door open for ladies. What do you think? Is this a good or bad behavior? Hold the door open. When you are in the car and somebody opens the car for you, the, the, the door, the door car for you. It's Is that okay? Behavior. That's a good behavior? Yes. Already? Yes. Yeah, right. So, ya no lo hacen, I think. <laughs> it's not done anymore, but it's good. Okay. What about this? Begin speaking when another person. It's a dreamer. 
before another it's a dream yeah uh, begin speaking when another person uh, before another person is stopped is that okay like interrupt interrupt the person no 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 right so interrupting a person is not like a good bad idea behavior. a bad behavior okay what about cross your legs Cross your legs, yeah, como cruzar la pierna, cross your legs in front of your boss. In El Salvador, is that okay? Remember, we are talking about cultural aspects, okay? Entonces, what, what do you think about this? Cross your legs in front of your boss. ¿Le ven algún problema a cruzar la pierna? Do you see any problem in crossing your legs? It's bad behavior. That's bad. Norberto, can you repeat? Eh, para un caballero sí se ve un poco... Femenino, femenino se ve. Ah, ok, ok. Pero está mal. Is it bad? Para un caballero sí. Se ve más formal estar correctamente sentado. Sit okay. up, please. Okay, like to sit straight. I don't know. Remember, this is pretty much como lo vemos nosotros. What your opinion is, okay? So what you think about it? So it's okay. It's acceptable. What about this one? Whisper. Whisper to someone in front of other people. What do you think about whispering? For example, I'm talking to Jasmine, and I'm like, hey, Jasmine, come here. And I start telling her something. Is whispering okay? Como, ¿Qué dice, Picha? Yeah, contar como eh, ir y susurrar el oído. You know, yeah. whispering. Is that okay? It's not good to balbucear. No, right? Immediately we get offended, okay? So probably not. And the last one says, put your feet up on a table. Is that okay? Like, put your feet up? It's bad behavior. That's bad, right? That's probably something bad. Okay. So, vamos, a revisar, vamos a revisar some of these in a couple of seconds. And now let's just move on with the next that you have here. So tenemos un par de palabritas que vamos a revisar today, part of the vocabulary to check. Number one is manners. Okay. So the manners, the way we behave. Okay. Appropriate when something is good or inappropriate, when something is bad, ladylike. For example, Ricardo acaba de mencionar algo, that for a man, crossing the legs, cruzar la pierna se ve mal, you know? Maybe because it is ladylike, porque parece más de señorita, you know? It's ladylike, como señorita, okay? Do you agree? Do you think? What do you think about it? To be honest, yo he visto muchos caballeros cruzar la pierna, yo no lo veo mal. I don't see it wrong, eh, pero that's my opinion. So probably you have a different point of view about it, and that's okay. Then we have offensive, we have rude, okay? Rude es grosero, right? Rude is bad. Y tenemos la última palabra que es swear, okay? Estamos hablando de manners, estamos hablando de cosas buenas, cosas malas. So this word, swear, in a general aspect, puede significar como jurar algo, ok, hacer un juramento. But, en otro escenario, swear puede significar decir malas palabras, ok, como maldecir. So, it really depends de lo que ustedes están hablando. You can say, oh, she was swearing, she was saying bad words, ok, y es swearing. Now, um, please, les voy a dar cinco minutitos, I'll give you five minutes. Y ayúdenme con un ejemplo de cosas que son ofensivas for you, things that are ladylike, okay, or things that are rude, o qué piensan sobre swear, okay, or manners, etc. So manners son formas, maner, maneras, okay, or the way we behave. Uh, por ejemplo, with manners, I can use the word good manners, are necessary when you have a, um, a business 
a business eh, meal, por ejemplo. Cuando van a una comida de negocios y no un almuerzo de negocios, good manners are necessary when you have a business meal, right? So, Teacher, regáleme un, un par de ejemplos. ¿Qué yes, Ricardo? Eh, la forma también de, ¿cómo se podría decir? Cuando uno alza el tono de voz. Porque a muchas personas no les gusta que les alce la voz. O que les hable fuerte, por decirlo así. O gritar. Ok. Yes, of course. Y depende también de a dónde está, ¿verdad? No va solamente a, a alzar el tono de voz. So you can use a couple of words. It can be speak up loud. Como hablar muy fuerte. Speak up loud. Ok. Or okay. puede ser shout. Pero shout sí es literal gritar algo. When you're shouting, ok. O cuando usted está molesto, usted yell. Cuando usted viene y le reclama a alguien eh, y le dice, pero por qué, ¿no? Eso se llama yell. Eso ya es gritar, ¿no? So shout puede ser como, hey, Brenda, you know? And that's okay, está shouting. Pero yell es ya cuando es está molesto. Sleeping, Brenda. Ya cuando está molesto. No, yeah. I imagine, guys, that's okay. It's Friday, you know, el cansancio de la semana es acumulable and everything. Pero gracias por estar acá. Thanks a lot for making the time for being here. So, uh, we got five minutes. Okay, me, ayudan, me dicen si necesitan ayuda with any of them. O si ya los tienen listos, you can uh, use your microphone and tell us. Hi, Hi Ignacio. Good to see you. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. That is correct. Vamos a, a dar ejemplos. ¿Quién más se me conectó? Abigail. Hello, Sandra. Gracias por conectarse también. Brian. Night, Hello, Brian. How are you? I'm fine. Already. Sounds good. ¿Quién más me hace falta? Me hace falta Marvin. Mr. Marvin. Hello. Y, y esa palabra gel se dice así normal, así, así como lo, lo acabo de decir. Yell. Yell. Yeah. Yeah. Yell. Yeah. Yell. Yeah. Yes. She was yelling. Uh, no yell, yell, please. The gel. Ah, no, 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 no. no. Uh -huh. sol, sol tiene que hacer porque gritar. Uh, don't shout. Don't shout. 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 Mm -hmm. That is correct. Hi, Jancy. Ready, one more minute.
Already, give me some examples, please. Ayúdenme con. Oh, ok, Ricardo. Ricardo, eh, si no puede hablar o si está muy fuerte, los puede escribir y acá los leemos, no hay problema. So, manners. ¿Qué ejemplo tienen con manners? So, manners son como esos buenos comportamientos, right? Ricardo está en la caja. The, the manner is, is necessary when I stay with people in meeting okay. in any place. Okay, amazing. Thank you. That's a good one. Anybody else? Do you have something with manners? Norberto? Yes, teacher. Uh, the manners uh, is so important in my work. Okay, manners are important in my work. All right. Eh, Norberto tiene dos devices. Ha conectado dos equipos. Mm, yes, in my phone. Ah, ok. Sí, es que lo veo dos veces. La pregunta es por el audio. Creo que eso me lo duplica también. Ok, but thank you very much. Oh. That's already. What about appropriate? It helps me with appropriate. What do you have? Díganme cosas que son apropiadas. What do you have in appropriate? Teacher. Yes. I'm here. Hi, Ignacio. Thanks for joining. Already. Uh, so, no, no sé si. Eh, no, se acaba de conectar hace unos minutitos, ¿verdad? Creo que ya lo había visto por ahí. Sí. Uh, ok. Great. Una, you... Tengo una sobre, uh, sobre manners. Yes. Tell me. Having having good manners help in our work. Having good manners helps in our our work. Okay, so having good manners help in our work in our work. Okay, that's all right. What about the following word? What do you have for appropriate? ¿Cuál, qué es algo apropiado? What is something appropriate? Hi, teacher. Uh, yes, um, appropriate is uh, greeting on the uh, when when we arrive uh, someplace. Okay, so arriving to a place, uh, greeting when arriving to a place is appropriate. Okay, thank you. That's all right, Rene. Please keep in the silence when when other person talking with me. It's appropriate, very good, yeah. So uh, like listening carefully, okay, very good. Thank you. Anything else that is appropriate, guys? Que es apropiado? What is something appropriate? Okay, I guess we don't have more examples. What about ladylike? <laughs> Do you have anything with ladylike, sin sonar sexista or anything? Um, so, do you have anything that you may say, oh, this is a little bit ladylike? Yeah, I have an example, the appropriate. Appropriate. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Algo que no es apropiado. Algo que no es apropiado. Eso tenía yo, pero no tengo los que están apropiado. I mean, sí Hi, good evening. Solo vamos a cambiar la palabra. Le agregamos in al inicio. Uh -huh. eh, Jocelyn, ayúdenos con el ejemplo, please. Is appropriate sa sal saludar. Si sí, que no puedo decir esa palabra. Really? Oh, eh, yeah, you can say, ok, hay varias formas de decirlo sin complicarnos mucho. Podemos decir, por ejemplo, say hello. It is okay to say hello. Okay. Say hello when cruising mm. between the people. 
It's okay to say hello when you meet people. Okay, very good. Anything else? Alguien de los que me hacen falta? Do you have any other example for me? Uh, Guadalupe, do you have something that is appropriate for us? The lady like like. Perfect. What do you have with lady like? When I go into the meeting, is necessary necessary go lady like. When you go to the meeting, it's necessary to go lady like. Okay. Okay. Yes, teacher. Como como femenino. The thing is that ladylike is la palabra femenino, digamos. Mm -hmm. Yes, Ricardo. Yo, yo, ofensivo se escucha. I'm sorry, Ricardo, no lo logré escuchar. I couldn't hear you. Si, eh, I don't care, se escucha ofensivo. Mm. I don't care. Ajá. Uh -huh. I don't care. Oh, con la palabra offensive. Sí. Okay. So when you say I don't care, it's an offensive word. De hecho, como, sí. <laughs> That's que, a good como, example. Como, como, mm -hmm. como queriendo decir que le importa, ¿verdad? Eh, no. Así well, es, no. No really. I don't care is no me interesa. Ah, ah like. ok. Pero si Pero yo sea, le no. quiero decir la que usted dijo. <laughs> Eso cambió un poquito y esa se la voy a compartir, guys, solo no cuenten that I did it. It's mind your business. So, mind your business es como, por favor, métete en tu asunto, right? Uh, Ajá, don't pay attention to mind. Mind your okay. business. Mm -hmm. O sea que la, 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 la oración anterior es no me interesa nada más. Como no me importa, pero no en el sentido, sí puede no, ofensivo, ser ofensivo, ofensivo, depende, pero mm, no necesariamente. Tú? For example, yeah. imagine that I tell you, hey, Ricardo, anda, no sé, anda grasa en la frente. You have some grease on your forehead. Y it's like, oh, I don't care. Yeah. Uh -huh. no, so, no, todo no, depende. Del de... gesto, como lo diga. Exacto. De la okay. la, expre oh. la expresión, la expresión. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Because mm -hmm. I can say I don't care, como, oh, I don't care. Así como, whatever, you know. No. Pero si le digo... I don't care, you know. Entonces todo depende de la entonación que le pongamos. Mm -hmm. Like what you wanna transmit. Mm -hmm. Ok, ok. Pero no se le preguntas si el teacher o sea que si, si digamos que, que le dice eso, que usted dice, ah, anda grasa. Y, le, y, el, y de, depende de la entonación, como que decir, o sea, no te importa. O sea, no le va a decir así como lo decimos normalmente, va. Nosotros. Thing is that, remember, sí. no te importa, no te remember that no es tanto la palabra, sino depende de que el gesto usted el gesto, use, el, el yeah, gesto como lo decimos. The intonation that you use, okay. that's what you mean. Uh, or, Because or, I can tell you. Yeah, uh, or, okay. or similar, for example, uh, if you don't use um, an appropriate word, you could often. So if you don't use inappropriate words, you... Could you could uh, often? Oh, could, could offend. Often. You could offend a person. If, yes. if you if you don't use um, appropriate, appropriate word. words, mm -hmm. you can offend people. Yes, I mean coming back with that word. It if can. you don't use the correct intonation, the correct it body can. language, yes. If you Ladrina. Sí. Si yo le digo a alguien en una conversación por decirlo. Y lo, le digo, no comentar a mí sería ofensivo. ¿Cuál es la expresión, sí, perdón? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo? No comentar a mí, o sea, no, no, sin comentario. Ah. En español. No, eso sería como no comments. Ajá, no comments. No comments. Ajá, mm. sería como ofensivo, no. Everything, no necessarily, no necessarily. Everything, de, everything depends on what you say. For example, no. imagine that I come and I ask you, hey, Pedrina, and, and what is your salary? Volviendo a la parte ofensiva de, de you know, yeah. offensive questions. Ah. I come and I ask you, hey, what is your salary? Usted me puede decir, no comment. Ah, y no, no, se, no suena ofensivo, ¿ya? Yeah? No Everything depends mm -hmm. on what you say y con qué intención la diga. Yeah. I can tell you, I don't, I don't care, like, oh, ay, vos que te fijas, you know, I don't care, ¿ya? Yeah? Pero si le dicen, I don't care, 
obviamente mm. todo depende de mi voz, you know, my tone of voice ah. says a lot of things. Pues so, yeah. probablemente una palabra no es ofensiva, pero usted la puede hacer sonar ofensiva. Oh, okay. And that everything depends on it. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, bueno. so. Así como like, yelling. Like when you yell, yeah. I mean, of course, ah, yelling yeah, yeah, is offensive. Yelling bueno. is offensive. Algo bueno okay. no prende el niño. No, pero oh. es una palabra muy útil, yelling. All right. So, ¿qué más yeah. tenemos? Give me more examples. Give me more. Nos faltan root, nos faltan swear. What do you have? Creo que es Norbert, pero lo escucho súper lejos, Norbert. O no era Norbert. Ok. So, anybody else nos falta. Uh, well, Moses estaba manejando. But Danny no lo he escuchado ahora. Danny, I haven't heard you. Jackie, Jackie is a little sick, así que, you know. It's Yo okay. voy manejando también, teacher. Ah, ok. okay. Yo solo voy oyendo. <laughs> Thank you, Marvin. Thanks a lot. I'm missing Brian. The, el Brian. Hey, what's going on, Brian? I'm missing. Eh, Angel. Ya no veo a Ángel. That's he, none he, of he, your business. Oh, that's none of your, your business. Is that is offensive. That is offensive. <laughs> that's a little bit offensive. Like, when you want to stop somebody, like, stop asking me about it. It's none of your business. Oh, but that's offensive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, yeah, let's move on, let's move on. Si no, nos vamos a quedar solo con las expresiones ofensivas, okay? <laughs> so, what about swear, rude? What examples do you have? Well, Lupe, do I you have, have any example? Mm -hmm. I have four, four root. Also, root go, go. When, when, when some, someone uh, don't salutation is rude. Okay, that's all right. Quizás cambiamos la palabra salutation, eh, más o menos, esa la usamos cuando escribimos, ¿verdad? Y puede decir, when someone doesn't say hello, para hacerlo más simple. When someone doesn't say hello, or when someone doesn't greet, se las escribo en el chat. When someone doesn't greet, or when someone doesn't say hello. Ok, very good. Good, good, good. Anybody else? Yeah, tell me. Uh, for example, uh, my friend is rogue. My I'm sorry, is my friend is rude. The rude, pardon. Rude. Yes. Okay, no, no worries. Don't be, don't be sorry. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good. My friend is rude. Pero rude es como malcriado, you know, like grosero, yeah. pésimo. Mm -hmm. uh, is every that so? Friend, every friend. <laughs> Every friend you have. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> okay. My friend Danny. Oh, my friend Danny. <laughs> yes. No, 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 Danny today. Danny? Yeah. Teacher. Oh, there he is. Hi, Danny. Danny, too. I am here. Hello. Did you listen to that? Yes, yes, teacher. What do you uh, think? Teacher. Teacher. Yeah, Ignacio. Teacher. Yes, Ignacio, tell me. It's raining me. here. Oh, really? Well, de hecho, no se escucha mucho. No lo logro. Yo soy, yo soy a Pango. Ah, ok. Está lloviendo, sí. Están viendo donde Ricardo. Ah, ok. So, eh, oh, but that's ok. Si en algún momento necesitan yeah. solo Después escribir, la luz. you know. It's cool. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. no, no, no. But, oh, my God. Okay. Okay, it's guys. For, it's for... Cool, cool. Let's move on. Okay, let's move on. Luego vamos a utilizar estas expresiones. But in the meantime, let's move on a little bit with this. Um, yesterday, estábamos hablando un poquito de etiquette. No sé si se recuerdan. Like the things that are okay, the things that are not okay. Yes. And, but now, let's summarize them. Okay, hagamos un breve summary of some things that are okay and not okay, pero vamos a def definir, you know, en qué tipo de escenarios. So, uh, you know that etiquette lo usamos para todo. We use it for everything. For example, at the table, okay. ¿En qué otro escenario utilizamos etiquette? No, o sea... Brian? No, perdón, perdón. Me dice oh. una interview. Okay, at an interview. Yeah. 
Anything else? On the meeting. Okay, at a meeting. Well, meeting, okay. Mm -hmm. In a meeting, I can change it, no problem. Okay. In a meeting, that's okay. Oh, in a meeting. Any, any other scenario where I can have some a specific dinner. etiquette? In a dinner. At a dinner, okay. Well, no, at the, on, table, on the table, credit table. at the table, yes. you know, summarizes breakfast, mm -hmm. lunch, dinner, business, dinner, business, at the meals. Table. Mm -hmm. Como en la mesa, ¿verdad? Todo lo que tiene que ver con, ah, con food. Okay. Mm -hmm. At an interview, in, store? in a meeting, at a store. Etiquette at a store. Yeah, why not? Why not? So it's part of the educational process, part of the behavior that we have, for example, when you go to a store. For example, si no le gusta algo, what is okay to do? What is something that is not okay? All right. O no ensuciar la ropa, for example, when you go shopping. I mean, those are like little things that we have to take into consideration. So, tenemos cuatro temas. We have four scenarios. One is at the table. At an interview, at a meeting, and the story. Danny? Are you sure? Yeah, we can have it at a church, but eh, no sé si todos, eh, you know, nunca, go, to, nunca, go, nunca, go to nunca a church. Pero... So we can, we can include it. That's okay. We can include it. But okay. I'm going to, se los voy a dejar libres. Wow, Ignacio, I'm sorry to hear that. Okay. So. Vamos a crear grupos y quiero que escojan uno de estos escenarios. Only one of them. ¿Y cuáles serían las normas de etiqueta? What would be the etiquette que vamos a utilizar? Ok. So, okay. vamos a crear una listita de cinco normas. You know, entre más puedan, pues mm. muchísimo mejor. But with five, that's perfect. So, tenemos like five minutes to go. Ok. And then we come back y las presentamos. Ok. So, everybody, let's go there. Let's go, let's go. No me unió, teacher. Se me desapareció el cuadrito. Eh, no hay problema. Está en el teléfono, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, sí. Ah, ok. Bye. Si usted revisa en su teléfono, le va a aparecer en una esquinita, si no me equivoco, es a la izquierda, le va a aparecer como un cuadrito chiquitito. Ah. Solo le da clic.
So thanks everybody and thank you for coming back. So we were like practicing and talking a little bit about the, yeah, I think everybody's coming back. So we were talking about this <clears throat> etiquette, okay? And so we have, for example, at an interview, what are good things, bad things, bad behaviors at the Me church? Wow, really? So no fue solo apagón, it's going. Wow, Brian, thanks a lot. Esperemos que regrese pronto. Creo que también donde Ricardo se había ido. No sé si Ricardo ya regresó. He's not here. Creería que también se le fue la luz. En Insoyapango, they es, said. Yeah, es, right. Aquí estoy, aquí estoy. Está todo Gracias, cargado, Ricardo. no hay problema. Thank you. Nice. Ya voy a cargar el mío también, just in case, you know. We never know. All right. So, gracias por estar todavía acá. Gracias por conectarse. And I totally understand that part. Yeah, well. so, Aquí también. Ya se quede en la luz. Hay apagones. Wow. Es que de hecho todo el día ha estado como bien oscuro, right? So, probably it'll rain. Okay. It's false. <laughs> Danis is terrible. Imagine he doesn't sleep. Oh my God. Okay. It's Friday. So, it's Friday. It's terrible, eh? Mm -hmm. It's terrible. Okay, guys. So, um, ayúdenme con cuáles cuál tienen. What do you have? So, what places did you select? Did you select at the office? What What did you select? My team uh, interview. Okay, at an interview. Uh, um, we select at the meeting. Uh, at a meeting. And first is we show. Uh, <laughs> we, we show. Okay. No, 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 when other person speak. Aquí estamos, dale, aquí te ayudamos, no problema. Ok. Um, great, eh, uh, meeting on time. Eh, uh, be present and organize. Yes. Okay, anything else? Alguien más tiene alguna recomendación? Like good behaviors for meetings? Uh, wear formal dress a meeting. Okay, okay, so wear formal dress at a meeting. Algo más? Anything else? Sería welcome and great. And great. Ingrid? Uh, welcome and great. Uh, get to the meeting on time. And great. Sería dar la bienvenida y saludar. Oh, welcome. okay. So yeah. welcome. Welcome and so greet. Welcome. Okay. Welcome and greet. Got it. Got it. Okay. Um, I, I? Yes. Tell me, Danny. Um, telephone in Ribeiro. Oh, okay. So to have your telephone in, in vibration mode, okay. Okay, I, I think we, I think they are like very good things, very good like recommendations, not only like behaviors but recommendations. What oh, about the the, the respect agent? But, uh, I'm sorry, can you repeat that? Como respetar la agenda. Okay, yeah, to respect the authorities, to respect the place. Yes. Okay, sounds okay. good. Okay. What about what about at the table? Tienen algunas como normas de etiqueta? Do you have any etiquette at a table? Algo que nos puedan contar? Anything you you can share? Yes, Ignacio. Teacher, how do you say cubierto? That's the silverware. Se lo escribo, I'm gonna write it down here. Mm -hmm. Yes, Ignacio? You're mute.
Ignacio, you are mute. Yo veo que se está hablando, but you're mute. <laughs> okay, okay. In, in okay. my group, sorry. In my group, Guadalupe say, don't talk when you are eating at the table. Ah, okay. Don't talk when you're eating. Okay. Okay. Or uh, I have to add something that is don't chew. Okay. Let me write it down. Don't chew. Okay. The mascar. Don't chew loudly. Okay. So uh -huh. I have to say it. Don't, don't chew. Okay. Don't chew loudly. Como cuando hacemos mucho ruido, right? Cuando comemos, I don't know, spaghetti or something. <laughs> and René, you no know what ruido. I'm talking about. Don't chew. Es como no masticar, pero así en, como un ruido, yeah? So don't chew loudly, all right? ¿Qué más tienen? At a table, what are some good things, good behaviors, bad behaviors? ¿Algo que nos quieren compartir? Do you use the telephone during of the meeting? Oh, you have at the meeting. Okay, so for the meeting, yes. What about at the table? Alguien tiene más eh, sobre las comidas? You know, when we are having breakfast, um, lunch, dinner. Yo miss. Oh, Claribel, Claribel, go, please. Oh, pero que hable yo, Silen, lo siento, perdón. Was that just uh, No, no hay problema. Luego yo, <laughs> diga su ejemplo. Perdón, yo, Silen. No, no, no se worries. preocupe. Okay. Ok. Uh, Miss, um, the elbows do not go on the table, only support okay. the forearms. Creo que okay. se pronuncia. Yeah, so yes. put your, put your forearm, arms on the table, but yes. not the, the elbow, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so the you forearm. can put like this, but not like this, okay? Anything yes. else? Algo más? Las abuelitas se molestaron yes, por eso. The seats se procuraron were staying the dinner formal in the other, the front and the other person. Uh, can, can you repeat the beginning, please? Seat. Uh, Seat. Mm -hmm. Seat. Oh. Seat apropiado were staying oh. the dinner formal. Okay, got it. The, yeah. The other person. Okay, so like to sit, to sit uh, in a correct posture, to sit straight. Okay, got it, got it. Uh, Guadalupe, creo que tenía algo más. Guadalupe, what do you have? Um, use silverware. Where? Okay, wow. yeah, so use silverware. Okay, use forks or knife or spoons. Okay, very nice. Uh, yes, Anadelmi, tell me, tell me. Ana de... No sé si Hello. se dice... Diga, say, say, excuse me when get up. Ah, okay. So say, excuse me when you get out of the table, right? Okay, when you mm. leave the table. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or excuse me si se va a sentar también, right? Could okay. be. Okay. Okay, don't, very good. Don't, don't or, splash. Don't? Splash, uh, como... Salpicar cuando. Como. When you put. When you speak. Yeah. <laughs> don't uh, don't yes. throw saliva. Uh, don't throw yeah. saliva. <laughs> exactly. Okay. 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 So, yeah, Me, definitely. No miren spray. Eh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Eso, Ricardo. Uh, no no uh, rolón. I was not familiar with the word, okay? But thanks for sharing, that's okay. All right, guys, good, good, good. So, ahora vamos a practicar un poquito. We are going to give opinions a little bit. And for this next activity, I want you like to speak as much as you can. So, antes de irnos y revisar la actividad de speaking que tenemos para ahora, que va a ser bastante interesting, tenemos un poquito de communication and etiquette. Last time, eh, lo hicimos en grupo, and you did it like super fast. Right. Now, let's try to do it on our own. Right. Intentamos hacerlo como, you know, eh, con nuestro propio tiempo, and uh, help me with the answers. Y ayúdenme encontrando the words that we have at the bottom. So we have etiquette, punctual, guidelines, 
late comer, polite behavior, manner, salutation, regard, and subject. So, let me know. Pueden escribirlas en el chat. You can write the, the words that you have. Si están en la computadora, pueden ir armándola. You know, you can download this material. Y la, las pueden ir buscando dentro de su propio material. All right, to make it easier. Oh, Jocelyn, thank you. So you took over mine. Um, oh, you got etiquette. Very nice. You got etiquette. Okay. Mm. You have etiquette. Si encuentran otras, you can select it as well. Oh, Sunny. Wow, you're good. Suger está arriba, dice la primera línea. Can you, can you, can you lie? No puedo. No puedo. está abajo. No. ¿Quién puede? Yo, Jocelyn. Es hacker. No, de hecho, ustedes pueden. No, you can do it. No, no puedo. Solo Jocelyn puede. Solo no. Jocelyn puede. No, no, oh, no, cómo no. Ese es feminismo. Ah, yo fui. Yo fui mi dedo. Ok, Dani select. De... Ah. No pueden, solo tienen que. Punctual. Yes. Uh -huh. Polite. Polite. Select the pencil in the uh, screen. screen paper. Superior, no sé qué, qué significa. Uh -huh. Yes, de hecho hay un lapicito en la parte de abajo, yes. en la parte izquierda. So, ¿Cómo se dice eso en inglés? There is a pencil at the bottom left. Hay un, bot un botoncito bottom left. Y ahí ustedes solo. Dice bolígrafo, flecha, color. Bueno, you know, teacher. So you it there. Mm -hmm. Teacher. Yeah. Teacher. Hello. Yo no puedo poner bolígrafo <laughs> por el teléfono. Pero está la teacher. palabra subject en la esquina superior Tell izquierda. Me. Hacia Ay, la a Jocelyn hay que decirle, está en la primera mm, línea, Jocelyn, ahí okay. que me haga el favor. Sí, primera línea, subject. Ajá, en la primera, ahí como sí. donde comienza comunicación está. Es hey. correcto, oh. bravo. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Ok. Yeah, ahí, so ya pasamos have... grado, ya pasamos grado, ya. Muy bien. Very nice. No, very <laughs> nice. <laughs> Pero todos lo pueden hacer, everybody can do it. Ok, so let's take no, a look. No, yo no puedo, yo no we puedo. We have control, we have polite. We have uh, guidelines, right? We have etiquette. We have... Uh, Latecomer. Latecomer. Yes. Two, three, four, five. Okay. One, we have here behavior. And we have yes. subject. Okay. Nos falta salutation. Nos faltan manners. Oh, thank you. Sandra ya encontró salutation. Very good. Okay. That's salutation. Nos falta regard, we are missing subject, we no, are near no, no, is. Re, 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 eh, a la no, parte no, no. behind your, uh -huh. no, no, no. Okay, uh, manners, okay, Sandra, encontré manners as well. Eh, Jasmine, si está en la computadora, I believe you are in the computer, en la parte de, de arriba, you know, dice anotar. Entonces, logran ver, si están en la computadora, dice anotar. Entonces, ese es su lapicito. Solo le dan clic en, yeah. en el color, you know. ¿Cuál falta? ¿Cuál falta? Nos faltan... Oh, regards. Ok, thank you. They already found regards. Eh, Ricardo, ya vi que ya lo encontró también. You already found it. Ya está manners. Ok. So you already got manners. What are we missing? We are missing, you already got salutation, guidelines, let's where, come where I think is, we're good. Is, subject, novel subject, can you behavior? help me? Right here, this one, in pink. Subject está arriba, yeah. teacher. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, subject, no, okay. so we are complete. Okay. Bien, bien, bien bonito okay. quedó. Yes, <laughs> very nice. Yeah, very well. No, but you know, the good thing is that encontramos una opción diferente. We already found a different uh, way, and that's cool. I didn't use it before. Okay, so I will use it now. Thank you. Very cool. Sorry. Okay. I will stop presenting. Toy, okay. toy, toy, toy new. 
<risa> ok, no, tenemos la siguiente. Vamos a revisar entonces solamente uh, un tema que quedó pendiente. Tenemos un par de ejercicios con could you and would you. Si se recuerdan, en the previous classes veíamos que um, podemos pedir permiso, right? Using could you. And would you mind, eh, de una forma bien polite, de decirle a alguien, me da permiso de hacer esto. Me permite, me brinda su nombre. You know, could I have your name? Would you mind if I ask you questions? So, revisamos este ejercicio here, grammar exercise, and ayúdenme con este. It says, identify and correct three mistakes in the requests below. So, ayúdenme a identificar tres errores. Where can you see three mistakes? En la cinco, could you come in? Sería, come, come. No se usa okay. ING. Okay. So, could you come in, you said? Ah, sería sin um, ING. No. No. Mm. Okay, so you say this one, like coming? Yeah. Oops. Okay, so coming. De hecho, sí, that and is totally fine. And second, you call. Mm -hmm. And second, you call. It's mistake. Okay. So you mentioned... Order? Order? Coming. ¿Cuál es la otra, perdón? What order? is the other one? Order? Second, you call. Second? Ah, second, you could. Okay. What is the Number other four? one? Number four, Number uh, four. My, I mean, or, ordering. Ordering. Mm -hmm. Where is the order? mistake? Order? Don't you mind ordering? Mm -hmm. Ordering. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. si, se, si se recuerden, después de mine, vamos a hacer el cambio, right? Después de mine, utilizamos ING. So, oh. pero no se puede después de QR. Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, mm, yeah. number five dice, could you come in? No se puede come in. Tendría no. que ser, could you come, ¿verdad? Hasta oh, ahí. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay, so, you. Eh, number two, you said, you could. Pero es una pregunta. Entonces, cambiamos el orden. Tendría que ser, could you? Could you? Yeah, no you could, sino could you. Ok. Nos falta uno. We are missing one more mistake. En la three, teacher. Mm -hmm. What is the mistake? Ah, would you send in? Pero no dice, ah, pero no dice, no. No dice would you mind? mind, exacto. Tendría ah, que ser, ve, would you mind sending? Very good. Yeah. Ya va queriendo, ya va queriendo. Excelente. Ya me grabó. Yeah. Yes. No, sending está súper bien, <laughs> solo que le falta mind, como se dijo. Yes, very good. Excellent. Okay. Good night, Richard. Sí, le... ya estoy graduado, ya, ya, ya. <risa> kinder, de kinder. De <risa> kinder, de prepa. De vamos a prepa. De kindergarten. Ok, so ahora sí vamos a like the activity we got to do. Ok, vamos a hacer un poquito de speaking today, giving opinions, you know, thinking about it. Y hay cinco preguntas. There are five questions that I want you to discuss, pero no solamente decir yes or no. But I want you to try to give a personal opinion. For example, number one says, what recommendations would you give a foreigner visiting your country who would like to show good manners? For example, you go to El Tunco, okay? And you meet people from Australia, you meet people from, um, I don't know, England, Germany, et cetera. And they are like, hey, what is something that we can do in El Salvador? So, quiero que les demos recomendaciones a este foreigner, okay? A este extranjero who is visiting the country. Because remember, eh, las cuestiones culturales son diferentes, ya? Yeah? So, they do something, okay. nosotros hacemos cosas diferentes. ¿Cómo vamos a dar recomendaciones? Veíamos anteriormente la parte de should. Oh, you should do this. You shouldn't do this, okay? So, no debería de tirar piropos, for example. You shouldn't use... Pick up lines, okay, with girls, etc. So, vamos a dar recomendaciones. Number two, what are some examples of bad manners on the bus? Uh, ya sea que usen el bus o no lo usen. What are some bad manners? Algunas cosas that you see like, I know, en el bus people do everything, but what are the bad manners? 
for example, eh, hay una palabrita, there is a word that oh. I oh. use, que es leader. Leader es tirar la basura en la calle, you know. Ah, so okay. when people are in the bus, sacan la mano, they take out the hand, and okay. throw the garbage away. Okay, so that's leadering. So I think that's a bad manner, okay? Three, llevar, what are... Llevar, llevar suelto por los niños también. Llevar suelto. Ah, moneda, sí, moneda. Es esto, es que, <laughs> yes, ah, yes, money, moneda, money. Money. Suelto es dinero. O sea, But cuando... Money. O sea, llevar cabal, aquí. llevar cabal. Ajá. Yes. Ah, ok. Ah. Que no voy a poder con otro... Ajá. Si le cobra, okay. no va a poder con yes. de 20. Porque si, ah. si le da el de 20, no le da vuelto. The ah, ok. The steel. Ok. They lose it. Ok. Eso yes. va a ser el tipping. Ok. Sí. Three. What are some examples of bad manners that you hate? Cosas que usted realmente dice, oh, I hate this. Ok. And four. No comer, do you no think it's, is it good manner to hug or kiss another person while greeting? Well, ahora por el coronavirus, I think we don't do it anymore. Y si lo hacemos, you know. But what do you think? Is it okay or is it bad? Si alguien le da un abrazo como, hey, hello, nice to see you. And they hug you or they kiss you in the cheek. Is that okay? Is that acceptable? Yeah. No. And uh, or not really. Y la última, do you say hi to people even if they are strangers? Alguien que usted no conoce. Somebody who is a stranger. Do you say hi? Saluden a extraños? Or only people uh... you know? Is it okay to say okay. hello to everybody? Yes, yes. for education. Ah, yes. uh -huh. or, 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 or is it like not a good idea? O cuando van caminando en San Salvador, I don't know, saludan a todos. Do you say hello to everybody? Or not no. really? Yes. No, no, no. no. Uh, teacher, so if, if, if the, teacher yes. if the foreigner is girl, he's good. Yes, <laughs> that's, no. sex, that's sexism. <laughs> Eso es, es sexismo. No, just kidding. Yeah. Okay, so vamos, vamos a discutir. Remember, the idea is to give your opinion. So it doesn't matter si están de acuerdo, si no están de acuerdo. You can freely express your idea. And this is like the opportunity we have mm -hmm. para practicar tanto como podamos. So listen to your classmates. Respeten las ideas de ellos, respect your classmates too, and, but participate, please. So participate. Talk, ok. Tenemos like 15 minutitos y luego quiero que escojan una de ellas para que nos la presenten. So you can present it. So everybody go, go, go. Saludos, solo si una camisa de banda de rock. Saludos, si una camisa de banda de rock. Excuse me? Y llevo una camisa de alguna banda de rock, sí lo saludo. Ah, oh, ok, ok. Oh, ok, ok. Somebody you say, oh, that's my, that's my buddy. Yeah. <laughs> my buddy, ok, ok. Gracias, okay. okay. Ingrid. Thanks a lot for, for joining. Ya se un poco la lluvia. Or the steel. Creo que Ingrid ya se fue. Ok. Ok, guys, me indican si necesitan ayuda para entrar. Si ya todos pudieron entrar. You're there. You're ready.
So hi everybody and thanks for coming back. Ok, gracias por, por seguir aquí a, a pesar de la lluvia, los truenos, los relámpagos and everything. I'm super happy that you're still with us. Um, that was a very nice and interesting mm. uh, talking time, I would say. Uh, talking about like some of the etiquette mm -hmm. and some of your opinions. So I think it's very productive. Siempre que tenemos la oportunidad de give opinions, you know, intentemos hacerlo in English, right? So, eh, presionense ustedes, push yourself, eh, pónganse el reto de, okay, I will give it a try, okay? Mm -hmm. So, um, I want to have just volunteers because eh, some are having some technical issues, así que if you would like to give your opinion, that would be wonderful. Number I one see. says, what recommendations would you give a foreigner visiting your country? Richard, what recommendations would you give? Yes, eh, pero at, uh, question three. Oh, question number three. Yes. What are some examples about manners that you hate? Okay, what is yes, something that yes. you hate? Uh, sorry. Eh, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. No hay problema, take your time. Vaya, y dice, what are some examples, example mm -hmm. of bad money that you have? Mm -hmm. uh, that you hate, that you hate, yes. that you said odia, that you hate. Yes, okay. uh, throw treasure on the street. Okay, throw uh, trash, okay. Trash, yes, uh, don't do immoral acts. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do, do not speak on the street. Don't speak on the street. Speak. What do you mean? Uh, spit. Speed. Spitting. Sí, spit. Oh, bueno, con, con te, con that's... Te. Yeah, L S P I T, spit. Spit. Sí. Wow, that's a good word. That's a really good word. Eh, okay. Chat. Ahí lo ahí lo puse, creo que. Thank you, spit. guys. Yeah, thank you. Exactly. Ricardo eh, is sharing in the chat one word that is spit. Okay. Sí. That's yes. a very good word to know. Like uh, when you are in the street yeah. walking. It's a limpia, you know, uh, the saliva yes, and everything, acala. and acala. you put it on the street. Yuck. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Uh, so, uh, spit in. Mm -hmm. uh, ese, ese no sé cómo se pronuncia, pero lo voy a intentar. Dígala hitting, o escríbala. Hitting children in the stream. The uh, hidden, okay. Lo, lo voy a escribir yes. porque necesito ayuda ahí. Yes. I think it's hit, the golpear, hitting. Yes, yes, yes. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, hitting. Yes. Uh -huh. So mm -hmm. hitting yes. children on the street. Okay. Yes. Yes, um, I was telling them something similar that I don't like it. I don't like when mothers are hitting children. Yes. I mean, yes. Pero en el sentido no de un castigo, because it's different. Sino uh, en el sentido de maltrato. mistreating. Exactly. Mistreating. Se maltrato. Ah, okay. Yes. So o, sea que, teacher, o sea que lo puedo cambiar. Eh, hitting por mistreating. Mistreating es maltratar. Ah, okay. And hitting es literalmente golpear, ¿verdad? Ah, Entonces depende okay. de lo que usted quiera decir. Punisher. Okay. Yeah, so, what, what yes. is it? Punisher es castigar. Punish, yeah, but, but, punish. but punishment, uh, there are different type of punishment. So, punish can be, for example, el punish. So punish can be like, okay, no vas a ver tele, you want CTV, you want ah, okay. video games. Punishment no necesariamente es corporal punishment. Ah, ok. Vemos a Dani acompañado. Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> Ignacio says My making daughter. noise when eating. Oh, that's something you hate. Okay. Anybody else? ¿Qué, qué es algo que no les gusta? What is something that you really hate? Hi, Otra baby. que habíamos puesto era, que habíamos puesto, teacher, con Ricardo, era eh, el not helping on the adults cross the street. Can you repeat that, please? Not helping eh, on the adults cross eh, the street. That is something ah, that you hate. Como ayudar. Yes. 
not uh -huh. help you, she said. No yes. ayudar a los adultos okay. a cruzar uh -huh. la calle. Yeah. Okay, it's so not general. helping. Already? Okay. Finish. Perfect, Finish. that sounds very nice, sounds super cool. Okay, what about the rest? What about the uh -huh. rest? Yeah, and tell me another, that. Another teacher, um, the little, little tree mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> it, it is uh, mm -hmm. no, it's, no smoking in the public place. Okay, so smoking in a public in a public place is something that you hate. Okay, that makes sense. All right. Okay. Guys, uh, let, help me please with the first. Ayúdenme con el primero. So, what recommendations would you give a foreigner visiting the country? ¿Qué tienen en la primera? O si no les cogieron, it's okay. Ayúdenme como a completarla. ¿Con cuál sería la, lo que le recomendarían to a person from a different country? So, um, what should visiting. they do? Mm -hmm. visiting, they are uh, visiting the country. The uh, visiting the Tunku Beach mm -hmm. because um, um, Quality seafood. Oh, okay. About the, the places. Sí, so that's yeah. That's a good recommendation. Okay. Different different drink. Um, coconut. Okay. Coconut. Okay. What, besides places to visit, what about good manners? ¿Cuál sería alguna de las cosas que in a different country ellos no hacen o hacen, pero para nosotros está mal visto? Something that we don't accept ah. or something that we accept. Uh huh. Do you have any idea, number one? Yeah, for example, manner? I should you shouldn't go go out at night because it's very dangerous. Oh, okay, okay. So you shouldn't go out at night. Yeah, and it's dangerous for them. Okay, that's a good one. So, vamos a seguir hablando de este tema, you know, on Monday we are going to continue talking a little bit about this. In the meantime, guys, ya casi no se nos termina la hora, así que eh, regálenme un segundito, solamente let me go ahead and check attendance de lo que me hacía falta y para que revisamos la tarea también, right? So, let me see, me hacía falta Brian, pero ya estaba don Brian por ahí. Eh, está por acá. Thank you, thank you, Marvin. Ok, eh, Danis, me hacía yes. falta Giovanni, pero I saw Giovanni already there. Eh, Sandra Vigay también ya la vi por ahí. Ana ya sí, she was there some minutes ago. Carlos, Carlos está por acá. Yes, here. Yes, thank you very much. And Allá, Ignacio, lo me hacía falta Ignacio también. No, but creería que es por el audio. Okay. Oh my God, tenemos full house. Yes, yes, super, super cool. So, gracias a todos por acompañarnos. You know, una semana más, yo sé que es a big sacrifice, pero like, I'm super eh, thankful que todos nos conectemos every single day. Now, tenemos una tarea. We have one homework assignment en la plataforma y tenemos eh, as el día martes para poder completarla, ok, so tienen todo el fin mm -hmm. de semana to complete it si ustedes se van a nuestra plataforma so you can go to our platform ok, y van al mismo lugar donde encontraron los verbos en el mismo lugar donde hicieron la tarea anterior, van a encontrar algo que se llama shadowing technique si you mm -hmm. no tienen acceso ahorita you can take a look at it and uh, it's called shadowing technique les voy a comentar más o menos qué es lo que hacemos con esta shadowing technique. Shadowing technique significa que ustedes van a ver ese video, es de dos minutitos, lo ven, lo escuchan, okay, lo practican y lo van a decir exactamente igual como está en el video. Okay? Exactamente igual. Es un video de Simple Pass. Ok, entonces para que practiquemos también Simple Pass Questions, los verbos en pasado, en everything. Y no solo una lista de verbos, sino que las practicamos. So, lo escuchan. Ahí está también como se dice. Está el, el subtítulo, el caption and everything. So, pueden hacerlo. En, los voy a dar la libertad de hear. Lo pueden hacer en parejas. You know, hacen una video call y lo graban. Eh, y me comparten el, el link. Ok. 
o le piden a algún amigo que tengan que les ayude, you know, eh, porque son dos personas, entonces le pueden pedir a un familiar que les ayude, ustedes leen una parte, alguien, uno de sus amigos lee la segunda, lo graban en the standard, o ustedes bueno. hacen una voz diferente. Sorry, guys, creo que ya empezó a llover acá. Aún no aparece, teacher. No les aparece. Tendría no. que lo, lo subí ahora tempranito. Se van a discusiones. Home, speaking forward y you need one. Se van a discusiones. Todo. Ay, no, perdón. Entonces creo que lo escribí en otro lado. Ya se lo voy a actualizar entonces. So, pero lo que van anulado, a hacer es... Anulado, anulado. No, 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 porque necesito que practiquemos listening. I want you to practice listening and I want you to practice yes. pronunciation too. Ok, so tomes el tiempo, please, para hacerlo. And uh, cualquier duda me la escriben en el chat y ahí la resolvemos. Um, ok. So, chicos, nos vemos el... Oh, por favor, me ayuden con las tareas si se les ha quedado alguna tarea pendiente. Eh, completemos la semana 2. Gracias a quienes ya me mandaron hasta la semana número 4. You know, thanks a lot for that. Y pues si nos hemos quedado atrás, intentemos avanzar as much as we can. Perdón, de en nada, la tarea 3. En la semana 3. Dani, me falta. <risa> no, semana 3, por favor. <risa> Nos vemos, que descansen. Bye bye. 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 Bye bye.
Hello, Miss. Hola, Miss. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo está? How are you? Oh, pensé que no eran esta. No, como no es la misma. Ya. No, no usted, estamos utilizando otra. Sí. ¿Y usted ya lo había dicho? ¿O yo no escuché? Ah, sí. <ríe> sí, sí, sí. Ya, ya lo habíamos comentado que solamente nos quedamos acá, right? Uh -huh. Ya no nos salimos de la miren. Uh -huh. Pero no se preocupe, no, no, no hay problema. No, pero me refiero que sí lo dijo durante la clase. Ah, sí, in the last, in the last seconds. <ríe> pero yo creo que ya iba de salida probablemente. Ah, so that's no why. Uh -huh. Y estaba en proceso. No, no hay problema. That's totally fine. So, gracias, Miss. Gracias por, gracias por conectarse. Gracias por estar acá. Eh, no le voy a robar mucho, mucho tiempo, de hecho. Eh, so, nuestra oh, one on one sí. es como para, para recibir feedback o para ver si hay algún tema que usted considere que está teniendo dificultades y que podamos revisar together or uh, like any any comment or anything que, que you know que sea worth mentioning so um, co por cierto cómo siguió uh, are you feeling better now ya mejor y aquí tengo mis lentes nuevos my glass new my new glass ah, okay. <laughs> Great, great, that sounds good. Sí, me imagino que eso was like a pain in the neck, le estaba afectando a lot, pero me alegra que, que ahora sí, you know, your eyes are better y que ya vamos a estar like super ready también. Eh, ¿Cómo se yeah. siente con estos temas? Ay, la verdad que tengo que repasarlos un montón porque sí me está costando un montón, bastante. Pero cre mm -hmm. creo que okay. según el avance que hemos tenido, ¿verdad? Que va a ir aumentando más. Uh -huh. Ya, yeah, va a llegar un momento en el que solamente es revisión, ¿verdad? Es como re revisión, revisión de los temas que tenemos, but ahorita sí es como ya empezamos a avanzar as much as we can, y la idea es eh, meterse a todas las clases, practicar en todas las clases, you know, para no sentir esa brecha o que tenemos por ahí una laguna de algún tema o que no entendemos cómo utilizarlo, ¿verdad? Eh, so... Eh, quizás lo, lo único, I would say, eh, bueno, con, con las tareas siempre es súper responsable. Yo no tengo ningún issue con eso. Me las estrellan entregando todas súper bien. Eh, por el momento, quizás solamente eh, siento que no, no, no me logra participar lo suficiente. Yo sé que ha tenido un par de, de dificultades there, pero, sí. pero espero que ahora sí. Sí, la verdad que sí, eso sí es verdad. Pero en no estos falta... días sí, ya voy a sentirme un poco más, sí. casi más bien para poder estar participando como antes. Nice. nice, nice. Sí, ya nos falta una semanita, entonces es de aprovecharla porque, bueno, afuera de clases definitivamente es bien difícil practicar, you know? entonces es de aprovechar, ¿verdad? Esos segunditos que tenemos para poder give opinions, practice English, etc. Eh, ¿Hay algún tema ahorita que sienta que que definitivamente yo tienen que que le, le cuesta como mucho que podamos revisar. No, solamente yo tengo que, que repasar. Tengo que repasar mis sí, anotaciones re... en la clase y eso, pero. Uh -huh. Sí, re, revisa quizás los simple past, revisa la parte de could, would you mind para pedir ayuda. Eh, la próxima semana comenzamos con futuros. You know, para que ya combinemos presente, pasado, futuro. Entonces, ya, yeah, es como de, de ir ahí, ¿verdad? <ríe> de ir ahí. Lo, ajá. Y que así nos vamos sí. moviendo bastante rápido. Uh -huh. Pero Entonces, sí, cualquier solo... cosita, si hay algún... Dígame. No, no, no. Solo sería que yo tengo que repasar. Uh -huh. Sí, revise los temas y si hay algo que no le queda claro, let me know para tal vez... Podemos aprovechar unos cinco minutitos de la clase y retomar este tema, right? That would be nice. Ok. okay bueno, gracias. gracias entonces por unirse, ¿no? Gracias. Gracias por unirse. Nos vemos el lunes con las super, super powers ready. <risa> ok. Yes. Y pues nada, a darle, a, a darle y a, y a seguir con la meta que tiene, mis. Así que tenemos que aprender inglés este año súper bien. All right. So, yes. gracias, mis. Que descanse. Sí. Nos vemos el lunes. Bye.
Bye-bye. See you. Mm -mm 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 -mm.